Hi guys, welcome to the channel and to the energy update for my friends Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus, so let's find out together what's coming through for you, energies for you, King of Swords, the World and the Ten of Swords, energies for your person, the Lovers, the Empress and the Hanged Man, what can we expect for this connection, Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Swords and the High Priestess, Nine of Pentacles from the bottom of the deck, energy about singlehood, this can be what can happen after a major conversation between you and your person of interest. They are stuck, guys, the hanged man. They are resisting a development for your connection. The lovers can be a soulmate energy. Your person doesn't want to make a choice. They are not able to make it they do not want to make it, you know, and this can disappoint you because the word and the Ten of Swords together can describe the opportunity to let go. The King of Swords can make a point clear, especially in this version of the card. It's like you can point out what you do not like about the unfolding events of this connection, your person may not understand you. They cannot picture in their mind why you may decide to let go of the connection. And this can be due to the fact that you are looking at the situation from two opposite points of view. The A priestess for you is a matter of intuition. Then, guys, after the conversation, which is long due, Wheel of Fortune, so you in particular can be aware of the fact that this conversation has to happen because the connection is kind of stuck. If for whatever reason, let's say from the conversation, you get the feedback that can convince you to let go, word, ten of swords, then you will cut communication with this person, High Priestess. No more words can be shared between the two of you. So let's find out more. Let's go for another round. Your person of interest can struggle with the idea to embrace a structured relationship. So this can be a romantic connection that is not yet official for some of you. For others, you are seeing each other, but you know, uh, something doesn't feel right. And the more questions you ask to your person of interest, the less they are able to offer you satisfying answers. They can be stuck in a mindset. Temperance for the King of Swords. You have been patient. Three of Wands for the world. You can turn your back on this person. Star energy for the Ten of Swords. Mm. Ace of Swords for the Lovers. Page of Pentacles for the Empress. Ten of Cups for the Hanged Man. Strength card for the Wheel of Fortune. Two of Swords for the Ace of Swords. Chariot for the Eight Priestess. Knight of Pentacles, bottom of the smaller deck. The offer that never comes, the offer that is not coming, especially if we think about commitment. Your person is settling for the bare minimum a page energy, when in reality, this connection, at this point at least, needs more. We need the night that is not showing up.
temperance, energy about patience, the willingness to find common grounds, the willingness to meet other people halfway in order to be productive together. At some point, it can become an energy about the opportunity to take the higher road. Some of you can do that. You will have, though, the opportunity to point out, explain, describe to your person why you are making such a decision about this connection. The Ace of Swords that we got for the lovers is the choice that your person is not making because of the hanged man and at the same time the verdict that they will get from you because you can be tired of waiting. The three of wands can be the consequence of your decision to manifest the word and the ten of swords guys because you had expectations in favor of this connection but these expectations are not met at the moment and you can struggle with the opportunity to picture in your mind positive changes if you decide to give this connection more time i want to say that some of you may have had enough of this connection you perceived the opportunity as a positive one, the star, but now we have basically jumped to the Ten of Swords already. It's almost over. It's almost over. Your person may struggle to think that you are serious when you can say to them that you want to move in a different direction. They can apologize to you. Page of Pentacles, lovely, yes, but not enough. I want to say also, guys, that maybe for a small number of you, this person can be a single parent, and this factor can hold them back for inner reasons, but they cannot sort themselves out. For this reason, they are working against the opportunity to manifest the Ten of Cups because they cannot free themselves from a mindset, from a way of thinking, from a way of doing things in romantic connections. And the Hanged Man and the Wheel of Fortune are two energies that cannot be rushed. Divine processes, they take their own time, but you may turn your back on this person, three of wands, because from your perspective, time's up. That's why in the potential progression, guys, the Ace of Swords, double Ace of Swords, is a conversation that can allow you in particular to make a decision. The Two of Swords, guys, closed off posture for the lady, moon in the background, something is off, we cannot understand completely a situation or a person, you have to go within if we follow the A-Priestess, you can ask for guidance, she is a tarot reader in this version of the card, but deep within the Wheel of Fortune can be an energy about life cycles and life chapters, it's about making a choice in this version. There are several options. You have to decide what you want, and as a consequence, you have to realize if this person can be an ally for you. Because if they only hold you back, there is no purpose, you know, in making the conscious decision to stay stuck. So the strength card, can be the desire of this person to hold on to you. They can ask for more time, but you may hold back indeed from the opportunity to allow this connection to stay alive. 
the chariot can be a desire, guys, the chariot for me is guided by the star. It seems that if you want to find a star, you may have to end this connection in order to look in a different direction and follow indeed your own star elsewhere. This person is not going to like the conversation, guys, but it's going to be an honest one, a truthful one. And considering the King of Swords energy and the word, which can be one about lessons, you will speak from your heart, yes, but also from your mind because the situation is not going anywhere. Even if there was potential, this person doesn't know how to move things forward. If we think about commitment, this can be a missed chance. I think also that it's this person that later on may have some regrets about the opportunity to fall short in the connection with you but this is none of our business if you're not satisfied with the current arrangement it's your right to make a decision about it a decision that should be in your own best interest and if this means that you have to embrace a window of time of singlehood so be it because a prince or princess valiant can come your way and if you are free you may very well seize the moment guys i hope that i made myself clear and this was helpful somehow some way if you want to comment like and subscribe it will help our channel to grow so thank you and until next time i wish you all the best take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye